Hello and welcome back to the channel Newcastle and Gates of Life. Today we are doing a walk from the Civic Centre down Low Pumlin Street and finish off at the Newcastle Christmas Market. So starting at the Civic Centre, we're now heading down towards Hay Market. So as we're approaching Thomas's church, heading down towards the Hay Market area of the city. So that we had looking building straight in front of us is actually here market metro station. Junction at here market where the traffic lights are can be quite a busy uh, junction, especially on match days and with Christmas shopping and stuff going on. So as we cross the lights at Hay Market, end on to the top part of North Pumlin Street. So on the left there we've got the TSB Bank. As I said, the weird looking building on the right is the, the metro station at Hay Market. As we continue down North Humberland Street, we've got the Milligan's Bakers on the corner. As we just pass through the anti terrorism bollards, walking down the right hand side of North Humberland Street, we've got various eating places. Building societies, the fruit and veg store, which has always been there for a lot of years. And we've got this big, massive advertisement board that's been erected in the middle of North Hummel Street a few years back. Ironically, North Hummel Street is about to get a total makeover apparently with trees and everything down in the middle which is about to start in the next few weeks so as we continue down low Pumman Street obviously on the left hand side there we've got the big Primark so the Primark built on the right a long time ago used to be British home stores and C&A so on the right hand side there, we've got like the Sainsbury's local store. Also coming up on the right hand side, we've got Marks and Spencer's. So if you look up on the top of Marks and Spencer's there, apparently that's a living garden on the side of the building. Continuing down, but obviously McDonald's on the left hand side, and on the right hand side, we've got the first entrance to Eldon Square on North Humberland Street. So, if we continue on down, if you look on the left hand side where JD Sports is, many years ago that used to be HMB. And also, at one point, it was a Hamley's toy store. And if you continue down again, if you look where the super drug is on the left hand side, that used to be HMV before it moved into the, the bigger store where JD Sports is now. So, continuing down. On the left hand side there you've got the new Sports Direct store which has just recently opened as it moved from across the road what used to be the old Woolworths building and coming up on the right we've got probably Newcastle's most famous store Fennec. As we pass I'll give you a, a quick glimpse of the Christmas window. If you look 
to my main channel. I have a full video of Panix Christmas window for you to view. If you would like to look at that. From everybody at Fennec, a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. So as we continue down the road, the building on the right there is the old Sports Direct store. And many, many years ago, it used to be Virgin Records. And before that, it was Woolworths. So continuing down on the right hand side, we've got the TK Max store, a few little jewellers. Okay. This used to be the former uh, Monument Mall before it was changed into these stores quite a few years back. And if you look straight ahead, we've got the Northern Goldsmiths building with the Rolex on the side. And if you see the gold clock, the Rolex also. Now turning right onto Blackett Street. Heading towards the Christmas market. On the left hand side there we've got a, a couple of new stores which have just opened recently. So we're now continuing towards Monument. You look straight ahead there where the big light up advertisement display is. That's an entrance to Ellen Square. And we've got Berries the Jewelers on the left hand side on the corner here. So as we turn left towards Monument and the first part of the Christmas market. We'll have a quick walk around the Christmas market. I've also done a full video on the Christmas market on my channel. If you care to take a view of that. Just passing the HSBC on the left. Got the first few stalls coming up. So as we head round to the other part of the Christmas market, that blue sh shop in front there, was the Island Pork little restaurant, but that hasn't lasted long. I think it only opened at the beginning of the year. So we've come past a few stores, we've got some selling wooden ornaments and stuff. The Jody Banner Company selling sausages, they're selling cards. Just continuing round, some more gifts, some more wooden ornaments. Some hats, scarves, gloves, looks like mould wine. And the big tower in the front there is where you get your German Brockwurst sausages and your Currywurst sausages. Continuing round to the right, back down the other side of the market, I've got chocolate kisses, hot chocolate, people selling pictures of Newcastle and various places. Some more scarves, ponchos, some more wooden ornaments. And a few gift shops. So we'll continue back up towards the monument. Continue round towards Blackett Street, passing the entrance to Eldon Square. The building straight ahead there is the Waterstones Bookshop. And as we head on to Blackett Street, we've got another entrance to the Fenwick store, straight ahead there. Crossing over towards the other bit of the market, which is situated at Elden Square, or as a lot of people know it as Hippie Green in the local area. If you look at that weird tower on my left hand side, that is actually a Metro 
Head duct. So continue up Blackett Street. Got the Greggs on the right hand side there. Blackett Street is one of the main bus terminals in the town where you catch a lot of uh, buses to various parts of the city. You were having a conversation with her. So now head into the second part of the market, which I say is based in Ellen, Ellen Square, but locally known as Hippie Green, as I said before. Place selling palmos, place ahead there, curios. As we turn around to the left and into the other part of the market. Place to selling various gifts, cards, place to take your own selfies. Got the war memorial straight in front there. Another place selling hot chocolate, place selling pork pies and pork scrunchions. Another place selling wooden statues and stuff. Place selling Christmas lights straight ahead there. A geeky shop. So we're heading back towards Blackett Street now, which is one of the main entrances to Allen Square. Straight across the road there, by the zebra crossing. So that concludes today's walk from Newcastle Civic Centre down Law Pumman Street and around the Christmas market. We'd just like to say a big thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notifications for when I release more videos.